Hey everybody, this is Marley and today I want to show you some projects that I made for a swap. Um, I'm doing this swap with Gisela and she is from Lavish Laces and I will put a link to her channel below. Um, I will posting this um, project to her today so first I wanted to make a video of it. Um, I've made three projects for her and I'm really nervous because I hope she will like it. And, um, I'm starting with this altered letter. We uh, talked about what we were going to do and well, we decided just to surprise each other, but um, uh, with talking through Facebook, <laughs> we just um, talked about an altered letter and I've decided to make one for her and she decided to make one for me. So uh, it was really a coincidence. So, <laughs> um, so this is the... Um, this is the letter for Gisela and um, I've decorated it with, um, um, how do you call it, Prima Marketing, Romance Novel Collection, how can I forget it, it's my favorite collection at the moment, I really love the design papers and well, Prima Marketing is coming out with some new uh, collections so maybe they can beat the Romance Novel but I'm not sure about that. So let's go to the letter. I will zoom in a little bit because I've used so many um, details on it. Here on top of it I've used some roses and some gorgeous Ziva um, bling. Here you can see a beautiful um, corner and some more bling. And here there is more bling. You can you tell I love Ziva swirls. And here in the middle you can see a Prima Marketing bird and I've... Um, this was actually... Um, a flower, some hairy flower, but I've made it like a bird nest and I've put some pearls in the in the nest so I think it turned out pretty cute and here uh, are the swirls and some more roses satin roses and some paper roses some leaves this is from the collection beautiful and I've used stickers around it and some gesso. Here's another bird. And here on the back you can see some chicken wire. And on top of it some more satin roses. And let me turn it around a little bit. So you can see here I've used a stem that goes all the way down and up to the, to the top of the ladder. The back. I didn't decorate the back, I just put some design papers on it, so... Because you pretty much don't see the back. And on this side, I've um, put some... How do you call it? Some... Um, from the necklace, some string here. And a pretty um, cameo here. Pretty lady. And... So... This is the altered letter. I really hope she likes it. I really enjoyed making this one. So on to the next project. I thought this was so cute for Gisela. It's um, I'm sorry for the noise. This is a spool and I've made it out of a toilet paper roll. So this is also from the romance novel collection and I just had to make it. I saw something on Pinterest so I decided to make this for Gisela because I know she loves laces and she sells laces so this was pretty much um, made for her. On the bottom I've um, put a rose and some bling and some liquid pearls and here I've hanged some, um, some down. I just can't find the word from the necklace. Some, um, I really don't know how you call it and there are some bells and here if you can see it right I've used the hard stick pin so she can take off the lace if she wants to and on top of it then let me move it here here um, you can see all the rolled flowers satin roses some leaves a crochet flower with a heart bling in the center some more roses and a centimeter so this was um and uh, this is going all the way down here 
So this was just a little fun project that I just wanted to make for her because I just know she loves laces. So this was a really fun project. And the last project that I've made for her, let me move this away, is this book. And I will put it there. And this was really fun to make. I've used again the Romance Novel collection and um, well just let's go to the first corner here I used um, a corner and some Prima marketing flowers and leaves and I did a lot of layering on this book here you can see a pretty large doily and um, I've put a clock there this was a printable and the butterflies I've uh, used on this project were also printable, so I print them out and cut them out by hand. You can see a gorgeous Siva swirl. I love this black swirl. Here I've cut out a perfect day from the collection. And here are some more flowers. This is a crochet one and I've put a pearl bread in the middle. Some more flowers and I've inked them with um, black suit. Here are some tickets and those are also printables uh, and I found those printables on uh, Pinterest. I haven't been long on Pinterest but it's really addicting and you can find so many beautiful projects and also the printables. I think they are gorgeous. Here are some more flowers and here is um, a heart with a wing charm. I recently bought these at eBay for a really good price and I just love them. Here is another corner and as you can see lots of stickles all around it. Here is another uh, Ziva black swirl. And here you can see another printable. Yes, I love printables and this is a clock and I've put some bling in the middle of it. Some more flowers from Wild Orchid Crafts and a big one is from Prima Marketing. And here is another butterfly, the printable that I've cut out. And actually the bird in the middle is also a printable, so I really love how it matches with the collection. It's really pretty. So let me move this um, book box a little bit so you can see it. Here I kept it pretty simple, just um, the binding and the bag is pretty simple too just the design papers and I have to put my name stamp on it but um, oh and this is the side it's wooden and I've put some gesso on it so it looked like a book really really cute and you can open the book and as you can see there um, I will put some goodies in it from Gisela for Gisela sorry and um, maybe later she can alter it like a shadow box. Um, I was thinking about doing a shadow box in this book, but um, well, I just decided to put some lovely goodies in it. And on this side, um, there is just design paper and some text. So she can write something on it. Some memories and notes, they just go in here. So this was a really fun project to make and um, I really love how it turned out actually too. So I hope Gisela loves it and well, um, that was pretty much it. Um, it takes a couple of weeks to arrive in America because it's all the way from the Netherlands. So um, I'm so nervous those weeks and I can't wait to see Gisela's video. And when she got it, I will put this video on YouTube. And well, I hope you enjoyed the projects that I've made. And I can't wait to hear what you think of it. So, see you next time. Bye bye.